our uh, Q&A video. We got questions from Instagram, y'all. And we're going to answer for y'all. All right. Yay. Yay. Let's get to it. Do the boys want a sister or another brother? Okay, raise your hands if y'all want a brother. Me. Me. Raise your hand if you want a sister. Me. Okay, Angelo. How do you find time to look pretty with the babies? I couldn't. I'm gonna wake up early in the morning and do my makeup before everybody wakes up. So that's my me time. Um, where's the ace son? Um, he's cremated. We lost the son. Do you plan on getting your tubes tied? No, dad's getting a vasectomy because I'm not doing that. That's right. That's not true. <laughs> That's false. <laughs> That's false. Are the boys homeschooled? No, 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 not yet. Not right now. Um, I'm thinking about it in the future though, yeah. Yep, in the future. How do you keep everything organized and not scream at the kids, Dad? Oh, I have like a routine and I showed all the boys how we're going to have our house and like I just keep everything organized. I'm an I'm a organized person and they grew on them so it's even more easier. I always ask them how y'all like it this way or, or another way and they like it the way I have it and we all just we gel with it. You know, it's pretty easy. It's real nah you you don't scream like you used to. No, I don't. I, t I know. I'm getting uh, way better. Like, way I hardly better. I hardly scream now at it's all. It's way better. Way better. This is, this is a little more organized. Yeah. And, and the kids, they grow into it, too. So. <clears throat> Do the boys get along well with each other? Boys? Yeah. But these two, they got mixed feelings. Like, they got their uh, the moments. Gigi and Chulo, they, uh, they got their little moments. <laughs> Which son helps out the most? The oldest, of course. Yep, Jamel. Jamel. Yeah. Did you get an epidural for all eight pregnancies? No, ma'am, I didn't get an epidural with nobody. I got a spinal, I believe, with my emergency C-section. No, that was it. What is the thing that the boys fight over the most? Mine is control of the remote. Oh. Sometimes the toys, like, say the toys. toys. How much is your grocery bill each week? Fifty dollars. That's so silly. I'm with three hundred right now. So if this is a day, will you try again? Do you love being a boy mom? Of course. There's nothing not to love. <clears throat> you don't have it any other way. How does it feel to be the oldest child? Actually, it feels good. Because we all help each other. What are you guys' nationality? The boys have an exotic look. Uh, I am Puerto Rican and black and a little Indian. I'm just black. I don't believe that. Just but we're gonna find out in the future, y'all, what she really is. I don't believe she's just black. Each time you've had a baby, does it make it easier since you've been a mother for a while? Usually after each baby, you have contractions when you're nursing and it gets worse. That part gets worse, but the actual labor, yeah, easier each time. To the boys, what's the most important thing mommy did for you? How many more kids do you want? Two more. How much do you sleep? Right now I sleep a lot. Do you and hubby still make time for date nights? Yep. Yes. It's very important. For the boys, what's your favorite meal that mommy makes you? What's your favorite? Like and cheese. The chicken. He's still blue, so he likes his cereal. <laughs> Cheese pizza for um, 
Jimani. Okay, so what's your favorite meal that Dad makes? It'll have to be a lot of chicken and chicken. What about you, Mikey? Pork chops. Pork chops. What about you, Angelo? What you like that I make? That I make, Angelo. What you like? Oh yeah, I can make good hamburgers. I make the best hamburgers. Mm -hmm. She go crazy over. What's your favorite meal that Dad makes? How about you, Joel? What you like that I make? What's your favorite that I make? I want. I want. I want. I want. I want. Eggs. He's crazy about eggs. I forgot about that. This is the hardest transition. One to two or two to three. What you think? Hmm? One to two kids or two to three kids. The hardest transition. Because I didn't have trouble with the first three at all. Yeah, it really wasn't hard. <laughs> yeah, no. it really. No, it's not hard. Three is like the small little thing. No, it's awkward little thing. I'm the oldest of seven, so. As long as you have a routine, you got food, you got toys, you can entertain, you can always have fun with your family. Life will be good. You got a job, you can take care of your family. It's easy. Everybody can get along because they're not fighting over stuff. That's cool. No, that's easy. Even when they was babies. Like, if you have a routine, everything good. How do you potty train the boys? <laughs> One of the boys were just ready and um, had started going randomly. Um, another we had to keep um, putting them on a pot every... I mean using a potty watch or a timer on your phone, just putting them on the pot for me. That was the biggest helpful thing for us, is just consistency with them. So, um, I tend to think boys, um, the hardest for boys is not peeing, it's pooping. So, pooping was the hardest part for us. So we definitely had to keep it consistent. What is your favorite quality of each boy? Okay, we have the helpful son, Jamel. We have the um, spoiled boy here. He He's really spoiled and he also follows the, he follows the lead of Jamel. Yeah, he follows the lead of Jamel. So he's very helpful as well. He's, yeah, he's joyful. Spoiled. Yeah, he's, he's joyful. Super, yeah, spoiled. super spoiled. He's goofy. He's always goofing around. Armani. He's the hyper son. He's my energetic. Angela. If you're down, if you're down, he will he will break your life. Angelo's Angelo sneaky too. Jimani. He will go sneak for He's some cake very cake. calm and well behaved because he's always to himself. Yeah, he laid back. He's very laid back. Tell us yeah. about him. Kaza. He's a little joy, huge joy. I love him to death. Little fat cheeks. I love him. Little cousin. Love him, love him. <laughs> He's smiling so much more. I love it. Brighten up my day. What state do you guys live in? We live in Texas. We just moved out here in Texas. Let's move. And also, we have a lot of questions about um, how do we do it and it's definitely teamwork you can't just single-handedly yeah. accomplish everything alone I mean you can but it'll be very very overwhelming but uh, yeah. she's super strong Yo-Yo's different but I do help around the house when I'm, when I'm around I cook I clean she does the majority of the time but Always try to help him. Jamal helps him. Mikey helps. And we just do it collectively. But we have a routine and we're very organized, so it's way easier. You can help him. It's just easier. Really. 
What is it like being the only female in the house? Do you feel like you don't have woman time? Woman time? I do a lot of self-care, so that counts, yeah, but. It's like Q&A, y'all. Thanks for stopping in. If you're new here, hit the subscribe button. Hit the like if you like this video. And we got a bunch of videos coming at y'all real soon. And if y'all have any videos y'all like for us to post, let us know in the comments. We got y'all. Bye, YouTube!